With virtual crash, forensic diagramming couldn't be any easier. Let's see how to use a point array, as a fast survey tool. Here we have a point cloud of our homicide scene. We see the victim's body positioned within the scene, as well as our evidence markers. We're going to use our point cloud to draw a line diagram of our homicide scene. Switch to top-down orthographic view. Next, we'll draw a filled rectangle to serve as our diagram's background. We want the background to be white. Now, we'll use the polyline tool to outline the scene based on our laser scan. Enable the snaps toggle. Disable grid point and grid line snapping. Enable point cloud snapping. Our cursor will now snap to the XY position of the point cloud, thereby increasing the accuracy of our diagram. Left click to drop the first control vertex of the polyline. With each additional left click, a new control vertex is made. Right click to finish the line. Check the clothes button, to close the shape. Now, We'll zoom in and fine-tune the positions of our control vertices. We'll also draw some lines for our interior walls and structures. You can select all of the line objects at once, and give them all the same line width. Let's place a 2D body icon in the scene for our victim. Next, we select the point array tool. With snap to point cloud still enabled, hover your mouse over the position on the point cloud from which you'd like to measure your fast survey points. Left click on this position. Select, restrict to plane, XY, to see the point array's coordinate axes. Next, by selecting, axis local, we can see the point array's local X and Y axis orientations. We left click and drag the Z axis rotation grip, in order to rotate the point array. We want the point array's X and Y axis to each point along one of the two walls touching at this corner. Remember, the pivot point of the point array tool is the tool's origin. That is, the pivot point is at 000 in the point array's own local reference frame. Therefore, this is going to serve as the origin for our fast survey. Our point array currently has no survey points in it. To add in survey points, simply go to the points menu of the point array. Left click on create. Hover your mouse over the area in the point cloud you wish to place a survey point, and left click. Since your cursor is set to point cloud snapping, your survey point should snap to the point cloud point your cursor is hovering over. You can add text labels to your points by using the text input field.
with our lines and survey points in place, simply hide the point cloud from view to reveal the diagram. Here, we'll select all of our points and enable the show text option to see our labels. Let's rename the point array object to my survey. Let's place a 10 foot scale bar into the scene as well. A few more fine touches and we're done. The fast survey point coordinates can be found in both the point array, and in the project report. Virtual Crash Accident Reconstruction Software